In this lab, we make sweetened butterfly pea flower tea. Butterfly pea flowers are actually very similar to red cabbage in that they can be used as a pH indicator. They change color depending on the pH of the substance that they're in. And that's because just like red cabbage, butterfly pea flowers contain anthocyanins, which are pigments that change color and can be different shades of red and blue depending on the acidity of the solution. Anthocyanins are actually found in a wide variety of plants. So when we look at other fruits and vegetables like beets, blueberries, and cherries, things that have reddish blue hues, we'll notice that they also change color in response to pH. In this lab, as soon as we add lemon juice to the butterfly pea flower tea, we notice that it changes color from blue to pink. The more lemon juice we add, the pinker the solution becomes. Eventually, we've created a super tart butterfly pea lemonade, which is essentially lemonade because butterfly pea flowers actually don't have a whole lot of taste. This lab is designed to make this intentionally really tart because the next step is adding baking soda. When we add baking soda, we see an additional color change. It becomes more and more blue. This is because the pH is changing again, and that's because baking soda is basic and has a pH of around 8. And so when we're adding that in, the pH is changing and getting higher and increasing, and we're noticing that through the color change. The other key thing that we're seeing here is bubbles being produced, and that's creating kind of that carbonated fizzy texture that we want in some drinks. This is because a chemical reaction is occurring. Acids and bases like to chemically react. So we have the lemon juice reacting with the baking soda. And when they do this, they produce carbon dioxide, which are those bubbles. Additionally, when they react, a neutral product is formed because they're kind of canceling each other out. So the pH is becoming closer and closer to seven. The reason we suggest adding some sort of natural flavoring at the end is because you've neutralized all the acid. Those protons that give the drink that acidity are no longer there. And so it kind of needs a little bit of a kick. So to recap, butterfly pea flowers are a pH indicator. They change color depending on the pH. Originally, we added hot boiling water to the flowers, which is a neutral substance. When we add in lemon juice, which is highly acidic, the pH drops. Then we add in baking soda, which is basic, and so that increases and brings the pH back up closer to neutral and maybe even a little bit past neutral. We hope you enjoyed this episode of Bite Size. Be sure to like and subscribe for more videos and let us know if you have questions.